Hey, what's going on with it once again? Bros, women, bronies, and Pegasus is the one, the only Mr. Nintendo Freak 2011, a.k.a. Criticism Guy 2009. And um, before I begin, once again, I got my Powerade, Grape. That's mostly my three favorites are Grape, the Green Lime, and um, Mountain Berry Blast. That's a, the other ones are alright too, but those three, they don't have nothing in comparison compared to those three. So uh, without further ado on that, let's begin. So uh, Nintendo Fan for the win, a.k.a. Um, Jimmy. This dude, he's basically got like 300, 450,000 something subs, so he's basically on top of the PokeTuber community besides Guy and Carl Garchomp, Jay Witz, Tamashi Reviews, Poke Maryland, which I feel like he's the one that started it all, Pokemon Maryland, because it was way back in 2008, like those seven or way back, in, way back in my senior year in high school, he started doing videos, and he took like a two, three year hiatus, and I didn't even hear about him until last year, he was coming back in the Pokemon scene, which is awesome as fuck, even though we never got to see his real face and shit unless people in real life have seen his real face. So yeah, let's get back to this dude, um, Pokemon fan for the win, aka, um, Jimmy. This dude's funny as hell, I'm, that's all I'm gonna say about that. I don't know what it is about him, but I remember way back in the day, this dude or whatever, like, um, I did, I don't know what it is, but this guy looks so much like this other dude, even though his name is Jimmy, but like, not me, excluding myself, I didn't really call him that, because his real name was, I think, like, Brian or Brandon. He used to get fucked around with a lot. He looks a lot like the dude. Cause I remember back in my high school years, I used to fuck around with this kid so much that he almost committed suicide, which is fucked, you know? I mean, I wish I would have been there to say something. Back in that time, I was kind of a puss a little bit. You know, I'll admit it. Back in then, in my freshman and sophomore year, I was kind of a bitch. I'm not going to lie. Then my junior senior, I started stepping up, and that's it. That's who I am today. Not a bitch, though. But other than that, um, let's get back to the topic at hand. Sorry, I keep stumbling off going off topic here. This dude, he does a lot of top 10 um, Nintendo related like um, video games. And he did a couple Sonic the Hedgehog ones as if you guys seen there already. This dude's really fucking awesome. He's damn fucking phenomenal. He's got a good ass head on his shoulder. I had no idea he even went to PAX Prime at all. I'm not sure if that was the year before, last year, this year. But um, this dude, he's definitely, you know, he's a fucking visionary when it comes to like making his scripts and everything. And you know, you know, thinking about what he's going to say. He's just straight out, top of the line fucking professional. Even though he could be a little derpy a couple times here and there, and he'll fuck up on his shit, but not as often as I do, that's for sure. I mean, this dude has got, like, a huge wide variety of audience. Very freaking amazing. I mean, I've only been subbed in since, like, March a couple months ago, earlier this year, but, you know, just, this guy's on top of the world when it comes to the Pokemon community, like I just said. Even though he's... Shofu and the other dude, GCPN, and all the other people I mentioned earlier are a lot more bigger than him. I feel like, in my opinion, he's probably one of the top ten of the best PokeTubers out there. Just to name a few, you know? Like, Saforion. I forget that dude's name, but it's something along that lines. Where he does the Elite Four thing, or whatever. If any of you guys don't know what that special is, definitely check that out because it was a good ass time. It's like once a week or once a month they do this podcast special. Um, I'm not sure what site it is besides YouTube. It could be a different one like Twitch TV or Ustream, whatever. Because Blah TV and um, Stickham got canceled way early this year, January, February. And, uh, yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say. And he's a huge-ass Pokemon fan like I am, but he has a lot more merchandise to prove that. <laughs> oh, yeah, and um, another off-topic. You know, I actually uh, found some old-school like um, tins and decks from 4th and 5th Gen, even though they're not old-school anymore. But the last two generations for Gen 4 and Gen 5, I saw a tin... A tin package for Suicune and another tin package, tin foil for, um, what's his name, Snivy. So uh, I might pick that up next month. We'll see what happens. And that's pretty much all I have to say. So like I always say, peace out, bros, women, bronies, and back sisters. I will see you when I see you guys. Have a good day. Have a good night. Wherever you're at around the world. Don't drink and smoke weed at the same time. Don't do anything reckless. One more other thing before I do go. I am going to be doing like two comic dub reviews, so definitely be on the lookout for that tomorrow. First thing tomorrow afternoon. You guys will see that. And I almost forgot about Daylight Savings. And thank God one of my roommates fucking remind me for that shit. Even though I don't have work today. Because I don't start till tomorrow again. And yeah. That's pretty much it. See you when I see you. Peace out. Lates. Goodbye. Be easy. Stay safe. And I'll see you around. Okay? And um, talk to you guys later. I'm gone. I'm getting the fuck out of here. Peace. Late. I'm out.